Hi, everyone. This is Arlene with Beacons of Balance. I'm here today for the first Wednesday of the month prayer and meditation for us and for the entire world, for this entire little blue marble that we're living on. We're in precarious times right now. This is needed. Each and every one of us are needed. And this is very powerful. If this could be shared with everybody you know out there, it's very important. So watching it, listening to it, if you're on podcast or on YouTube, you could come in and join this at any time. What I ask you to do is move out of here. For those that can't see if they're listening, move out of your head space and really drop into your heart space. Have it come from the heart. Our world needs this. Everybody needs this. So what I'll do first is I do this little introduction and then it will be a prayer um, after the prayer, I'll do a guided meditation. And then at the end of that, I'll do what's called toning. And the toning is done to, oh, great spirit. You just say the words over again, oh, great spirit, earth, sun, sky, and sea. You're inside and all around me. You don't have to be a songstress. I'm not, that's for sure. But it's a way that toning goes into every cell of our being. And it, it's spread out there into our world out into the universe. As I said, we desperately, these are desperate times that we're in. It's going to be a very, I feel a very challenging year coming up for all of us in so many different facets, not just the political regime. And it's it's interesting what's going on. It, it needs to happen. There's something greater that we, we don't even realize that needs to be happening. This is important for all of us. Before we start today, what I would like each and every one of us to do as we walk around our daily lives and we're living, we clear out things, things come back to us. This is our very important areas, our heart space. So what I would like you to do now is just cup your hands together and imagine it like a basket, a bowl, sitting right underneath your heart. Again, for those that are listening, just envision this, okay? Right underneath your heart. And as we go through, as we've lived our lives and go through all our days, we pile on these things that say are negative or hurt for whatever, and they're like big rocks and boulders that we carry around with us. We don't even realize it, but we feel tired, we feel drained, and they just keep filling up and they block off our beautiful heart, our beautiful area that carries our spirit. So right now, just envision that here and take it and just throw it out and empty it. Just empty it and clear it out. We're sending that out. And as we send that out, we're transmuting this. We're just not dumping it out there. We're transmuting it and turning it into total love and healing and just get rid of it and push it out. So we're nice and clear and clean. We're a clear vessel of light that's going through us. So right now, I would like you to quiet yourself and listen to this prayer. For, for each and every one of us, for the world and for the whole universe out there. And then we'll come back and then I'll do the meditation. So thank you. Dear Creator, we pray for this our world. We ask that you remove the walls that separate us and the chains that hold us down. Use us to create a new world on earth, one that reflects your will, your vision, your peace. In this moment, we recognize the power you have given us to create a new the world we want. Today's world, dear Creator, but reflects our past confusion. Now, in this moment, we ask for new light. Illumine our minds. Use us, dear Creator, as never before, as part of a great and mighty plan for the healing of this world. May we no longer be at war with each other. May we no longer be at war with ourselves. Let us forgive this century and every other the evils of history, the pain of our common fears. Remove from our hearts the illusion that we are separate. May every nation and every people and every color and every religion find at last the one heartbeat we share. Through you, our common father, mother, and the redeemer of our broken dreams, may we not hold on to yesterday May we not obscure your vision of tomorrow, but rather may you flood our hearts. Flow through us, work through us, that in our lives we might see the illumined world. Create, 
Sustain that world on earth, dear Creator, for us and for our children. Hallelujah at the thought. Praise Creator the possibility that such a thing could come to be through you, through your light that shines within us. So may it be, so may it be. We thank you, Creator. Amen. So now I would like each and every one of us to take in a few deep breaths in and out. In and out. And just imagine, I know it's through our nose, breathing it into our heart, coming into our heart space and breathing it in and out through our heart. Right at this time, I'm calling in Creator to be here with us. Just envision this in the middle of our circle here. We're joined hands around this beautiful marble, this beautiful thing, the beautiful blue marble that is our earth, that houses us, that's our home. Just imagine and see us holding hands as it encompasses this entire globe, this entire world. And right now I'm calling in Creator to be here and just imagine in the center of our circle here, this beautiful white ball of crystal light. This beautiful light is pure, unconditional love and healing. And at this time, breathe it in, breathe it in through your heart space. Breathe it in deeply, in and out, and in and out, and in and out. Dear Divine Creator, thank you for being here with us. Imagine this beautiful crystal white light that's filling this entire area where we are now, where each and every one of us, where we are, could be in our car, in our homes, in our workplace, in our bedrooms, it doesn't matter. Just envisioning this beautiful crystal light flooding the entire area with this in its pulsating, pulsating, pure, unconditional love and healing. So imagine it flowing out, flowing, filling your entire space where you're at. Right now, I'm opening up the doors here to my home because this is where I am, opening it up, and I'm seeing this beautiful white light flowing out, outside, outside, flowing out like this beautiful white lava, crystal white lava that's pulsating, pulsating, pure unconditional love and healing as it's flowing down the streets, crossing rivers, streams, crossing into the other towns, crossing into the other states that we're close to, flowing, flowing as it, along its path, sending it out right now into homes where there's abuse going on at this very moment, where people are hurting, where people are in pain and suffering, physically, mentally, spiritually, it doesn't matter, sending them and gifting this to flow it and flood it and spread it out there, touching their hearts, making that, transmuting it into this beautiful, beautiful, wonderful white light of love and healing. Sending out to all the hospitals out there, to all the prisons, to all the homeless, to the people that are in need, to someone that's out there right now that may have a needle in their arm or popping a pill and they're ready to exit this beautiful planet. Call them back. They are needed. They are important. You are important. Don't do it. Just bless them with this so it changes this radically right now and it changes their heart. Sending it into all the government agencies out there, to all the workplaces, to all the government officials, sending it to their hearts to transmute and change, letting them come from a loving place, a place of truth, honor, honesty. Pulsating, pulsating, pure, unconditional love and healing. Sending it out to all the war-torn countries that are out there. As we know, all the major ones, what's going on right now, how about all the little small ones that are happening? How about the wars that are going on 
inside each and every one of us for ourselves and our families, sending out their pulsating, pulsating, pure, unconditional love and healing. The fabric of this country is being ripped and torn and shredded, sending it out there to this matrix that covers this, this entire globe out into the other universes also. As this flows out, seeing across all the rivers and streams and all the great oceans, north, south, east, and west, sending it out even further into the cosmos as it reaches every star system out there, giving and receiving this back and forth, back and forth for all the beings that are right now taking their final breath, gifting it to them for their next journey to the next place where they're going, to heaven, their home. And for all the new souls at this very moment that are being born and birthed into this area, let them breathe in this beautiful white light of healing and love, this beautiful gift to gift them on their journey. Seeing it, as I said, reaching all the other planets, star systems out there. We're not the only ones here. There's so many out there giving it back and forth, back and forth, till it reaches heaven. That's the highest pinnacle that we could go to, giving and receiving it back and forth and being so grateful for all we have. And at this time now, Bring this beautiful white crystal light, bring it back into the center of the circle here. And at this time, put in it prayers for healing for yourself, your loved ones, for others, whatever it may be. You could say this silently or out loud. It is heard and felt, so be it. And as we're doing this, remember the important thing, remember to breathe in and breathe out. Breathe in and breathe out. Release and let go of all. Let's put in all of our pain, all of our suffering, body, mind, or spirit for each and every one of us for this entire world and all that's happening for the highest good of all concerns, so be it. So it is. So it is. It is done believe. Thank you. Thank you. Take a deep breath in and a breath out. Get in and out. Be in that place of peace. And at this time, we're going to do the toning. And the toning is to, oh, great spirit, Earth, sun, sky, and sea, you're inside. You're all around me. I'll be using this Native American drum that was made by my dear friend, Pat Callahan, who I always refer to, and she's in spirit, but I know she's here with us. So <clears throat> just let it out. Like I said, I'm not a songstress, as you could hear. And it doesn't matter, but it's important for all of us, for every cell in our body to hear. And all around me. Oh, 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 great, near, near, 
earth, sun, sun, and sea, your and star, and all around me, me, me. Oh, great spirit. First one star and sweet, the Lord in star and all about how it meet. Oh, great spirit. First one star and sweet, the Lord in sunlight and all around me, 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 me. Oh, praise be here. Birth, sun, sky, and sea. The Lord in sunlight and all around me, me, me. Thank you, everyone. Thank you for being here. Please spread this, share it, come back to listen to it. Every first Wednesday of the month, this will be happening. I'm envisioning this, manifesting this to grow and grow. The more that's done, the stronger it will be, and we need this. We so desperately need this, and just believe that. Believe it. I wish you all the best. You matter. It's all about you. With total love, be the beautiful beacons of light that you are. Shine your light out there, because we all need it. Namaste. Take care.